All right, we've got some multiplication and division. Let's go ahead and try one of each. Multiplication means you need to change this all into a multiplication problem so that you can reduce things. So I'm going to pull out a common factor. It's oftentimes something that people miss. Ooh, look, go away. I'm going to factor this x minus 2, x minus 2, because it multiplies to get a positive 4 and adds to get a negative 4. I'm going to get x plus 5 and x minus 2 because those multiply to get a negative 10 and subtract, or yeah, subtract to get a 3. So that guy and that guy. Looks like about it. So I have 4 times x plus 5 on the top and x minus 2 on the bottom. Let's go ahead and look at 20. 20, we've still got factoring to do. I can factor out a common factor there. I do need to switch these guys, so I'm going to factor this up on top. x plus 5, x minus 5, that's the difference of two squares. This guy here, do the diamond problem, x plus 5, x minus 3. Multiplies to get a negative 15, combines to get a 2. And now we reduce a lot of, ooh, this, oh yeah, that one with that one, this one with this one, this one with this one, and we have just next left over.